Mike here from Hogs Mission Channel. Welcome to the next episode of Fork It. Today we're going to be cutting up this old forklift fork and uh, starting to cut out our blanks for different tooling. Uh, one's going to be the angle plate, another uh, piece is going to be 2x4 uh, yeah, two by four by six blocks, then there's going to be some one, two, three blocks. Um, Probably some hold down straps and all kinds of stuff going to come out of this thing. Forklift forks, as you know, are forged steel and uh, should be pretty good to harden up and uh, make for some good tooling. So, uh, with, uh, yeah, without further ado, we'll get this thing fired up and on the way. This saw is running a 4 tooth for inch blade, so we get a faster cut. It won't be very clean, but it will be fast. With material this thick, it's better than having a 10 or a 14 PPI blade. Uh, it takes forever and the blade gets hot. So with this one, the cut should be well, about five minutes in the making. I'll pause this and uh, right before it uh, gets to drop off, we'll Resume the recording. Took a little longer than what I anticipated, but better part of 45 minutes instead of five. Take a look at the cut here. These saws are a little slow, but they do the job. You can see the cut here it doesn't look too bad. Really not worried about the cut anyway because we're gonna end up milling this all square and plumb and the whole bit so anyway this part is going to make a two by four by six box there's the lines already scribed in there so those are going to be the next cuts this piece is a little bit over 50 millimeters thick and I need 50.8 in order to get two inches so I'm going to have to put some material onto it, probably some 6013. 7018 is a little bit too hard to work, so probably go with the 6013 and just put another millimeter or two on there so we can plane that down and get a good surface on there that's hardenable. And then of course these L brackets here have to come off still. And the rest of the fork is going to make all kinds of other good stuff. This looks like it's going to be a long-winded project. So we'll continue on and um, I'll tune you guys back in when some more cuts have been made. <laughs> 